Hey guys, I wanted to give you a quick update on Bootsy. We changed her name to Betsy, although I kind of like Bootsy, so every now and then I'll call her Bootsy. Don't tell anyone. But uh, Betsy, Bootsy Betsy, the Black Lab Great Dane mix, the senior that we just rescued. Um, she's doing awesome. She's now met the entire pack. Everybody's all out here. It's a beautiful day. And um, yeah, she's doing great, guys. She's older, but she still likes to come on walks. And she's very sweet. And uh, I'm actually quite surprised that um, she integrated so well. I, I don't know why, but when I first met her, um, when I first met her, I got the impression she would have a, a high prey drive. She just seemed very intense. And I was wrong. As simple as that, I was wrong. She's very easygoing, very mellow. Um, you know, a few tinkles in the house here and there, but hey, it happens. You know, we've all been there. <laughs> um, but yeah, she's she's really a good dog. And uh, due to the fact that she was available for adoption for a year, she never, you know, was had a permanent home. I'm not going to have her go through that again, of course. Knowing that she's happy here, she's here to stay. She'll be a sanctuary dog. Oh, sanctuary dog forever and live out her life here, which should, which should be, you know, who knows, but she definitely has a lot of life left in her. She does look, you know, older, a lot of gray and stuff, but she gets up to go with the pack and she's, she doesn't miss a thing, you know, she's, she's out and about with all of us, keeping up with everyone. And she's just a great addition, a great addition to the family. It's always hard for me to get my words out when it's so cold. It's like 50 degrees this morning. Um, at this point, about an hour ago, it was 30, no, 40 degrees. Basically, you can see it's all frosted over. It's frosty. It's quite frosty out this morning. So, and I do that. I show you the frost so that you don't think I'm exaggerating. So you can tell yourself when you see my videos or the pictures of me with less clothing, you know that I get really hot. Look, I'm wearing a t-shirt, okay? I'm wearing a t-shirt. And in about 20 minutes, when it goes from 50 degrees to 55 degrees, this baby's gonna come off. And you better, you better believe it. You best believe I'm gonna make another video about something. Who knows what it's going to be? You'll just have to wait. Good morning, everyone. I hope you're having a beautiful day. I wanted to uh, fill you in on something. But really, guys, I cannot tell you. It, my, I, it is so... I get so hot when I'm hot. You don't want to mess with the bear. You don't want to mess with the summer bear. I tell you. They'll tell you. Tell them, guys. Tell them, kids. You like Dad when he's hot or is he a little too spicy? Huh? Huh? No animal. <laughs> Dad can't go to the animal shelter when it's uh, when it's too hot. Am I right? That's a uh, that's a fact. <laughs> it's almost ridiculous now that we have a second. Isn't it crazy how sad it is with, with no? Ch -ch hey, no, no, Dale, Dale, no, ch no. Who dug this hole? Oh my gosh. Crap. I'm not sure. There's no way they dug this hole in such a few seconds. There's no way. We just started this walk. It's not possible. Now I have to protect the hole. Everyone should always remember, protect the hole. At all costs, protect. <laughs> you guys still with me? Anyways, here's what I was saying. Now we have an audience. Now we have an audience. Here's what I was saying. This is what I was trying to say. With, with all of the stuff in the world, all of the stress in the world, all of the problems, the sadness, the terrible things, all of it, right? It is so important. This is one of the things that I've learned growing up with a social media following. The people who focus their energy and intention and, and, and attention on the things that don't matter have such little purpose. They have such little purpose and high entitlement. It's a high entitlement with little purpose. That is a recipe for a disaster of a life. Fo don't let the little things interrupt your focus, get in the way of your mission, in the way of your intention. Trust me on that. You see something that you don't like, see something that isn't your cup of tea, 
You don't need to give it your attention because the world doesn't care. Nobody cares. Why give it your attention? It's not going to do anything. It's, it's, only, it's only bad for you. And, and, and for the energy, the energy of society. It doesn't, it doesn't help it, right? Okay, I love you guys. There is Ken. I need to give you an update on Ken. Nothing but good things. That I can promise you. He's just really one of my favorite dogs. I love him so much. What I don't love, if we're going to, every, I have to humble them. I love every single thing about this dog. More, I can't even put it into words. He's my, I, I hate to say it in front of all of them. I really do love them all the same. He's really up there though. Um, but this, he, he gets hot at night, right? Which I understand, but for, he's a lot, a little bit more fur than me. Not much, but a little bit more fur. And at, in, in the middle of the night, he pants in my face so hard, panting and panting. Sometimes it, it turns into like a nightmare. I think I'm being chased by like a, a, a gorilla, a zombie gorilla coming at me. <sighs> Get off of me, you know? It's just Ken. It's not a gorilla. It's a dream. It's a nightmare. Anyways, I love you guys. Have a beautiful day. Bye.